Welcome to VOCA Anatomy Pro, a comprehensive 3D atlas designed to improve your understanding of human anatomy and gross pathology. In this guide, we'll walk you through the first steps to get started with VOCA Anatomy Pro, showing you the ropes so you can easily find your way around its features. VOCA is available in both web and mobile versions for iOS and Android. Let's start with the web version. When you open VOCA Anatomy Pro on your computer, you'll land on the home screen. This gives you quick access to the main features of the Atlas, the anatomy and pathology sections, articles, and help center, all right there at the top. You can also search for specific models, switch the language to whatever you prefer, and log in or sign up if you haven't already. Once you register, you'll get access to the entire 3D Atlas. If you're looking for a specific 3D model or article, you can either use the quick search option or browse through the corresponding anatomy and pathology catalogs. If you're into anatomy, just click on the anatomy section on the left side of your screen before selecting the anatomy category. From there, you can choose different sections of the body, check out full anatomical models of both male and female bodies, or even dive into internal organs. On the right-hand side of the screen, you'll see a list of 3D models for whatever section you chose. To keep things simple, these models are stripped down to the basics without too much extra detail. If you'd like to organize them, just hit the default button at the top right to sort them however you like, even alphabetically. Use the share button to copy the link to the current page. And if you find something you want to keep handy, click the star icon to save it to your personal collection, which is easily accessible from the top menu. When you click on any model in the anatomy section, it'll pop up in a 3D view. Some of the larger models with lots of details might take a moment to load, so hang tight. VOCA Anatomy Pro lets you rotate the model and zoom in and out of it easily. To rotate it, just point your cursor at the model, hold down the left mouse button or the touchpad, and drag it in the direction you want. For zooming in, point the cursor at the model and scroll up with your mouse wheel. If you're using a touchpad, simply pinch to zoom. Place two fingers on the touchpad and spread them apart. In case you need to move the 3D model to another location on the screen, just press the middle button of the mouse or click and hold the bottom right corner of the touchpad to adjust the model position. When you click on a part of the model, you'll see its name pop up in both the selected language and Latin at the bottom of the screen. Hit the eye icon next to the name to open a detailed article about your chosen part. You can easily move this article around on your screen by clicking and dragging the title. With VOCA Anatomy Pro, you can easily hide or isolate any structure you're working with. Just click on a structure and you'll see Hide and Isolate buttons appear at the top of the screen. The Hide button looks like an eye, while the Isolate button is shown as two circles. Hiding the structure gives you a clearer view of the details inside. If you want to focus on just one part and make everything else disappear, use the Isolate feature and click on the structure again to turn off the yellow light. The top menu also lets you undo any changes or even reset the model if needed. Plus, you can move the top toolbar around to wherever it's most convenient for you. To make explaining anatomical structures easier, VOCA Anatomy Pro offers extra presentation tools that are only available in the web version of the app. Just head to the top toolbar and click on the tools icon next to the right pointing arrow to take a look. These features include a pointer to highlight specific parts of the model, with options to change its size and color. To turn the pointer off, just click the button again. A text option to type notes near the model. Like the pointer, you can change the font size and color, and also adjust the note's position and size. An image feature to upload additional visual materials right next to the model. You can check out and explore different parts of the model and examine layers of various structures, You'll find these layers on the right side of the screen. Just click on a layer to see its details. If there are subparts, you'll find them behind a plus sign or a right pointing triangle. You can hide or focus on specific parts all at once by using the buttons next to their names. This allows you to build the model you want like a construction kit. For example, you can isolate the heart, unhide the ribs, add the aorta, and so on. To really zero in on the model, you can make it full screen by clicking the two arrow icon at the bottom of the right panel. 
This will hide all the buttons and give you a better view. If you want to capture a high quality shot of your 3D model, just use the screenshot tool at the bottom of the left menu. Get your model set up just how you want it, angle and size all sorted, then hit the take a screenshot button. You can either save the image for later or just copy and paste it right away. On this 3D viewer screen, head over to the bottom left menu. There, you can save the model you're working on to your personal collection and send your thoughts about it straight to the Boca team. To open another model, just hit the Models button in the top left corner. This will show you all the submodels under the theme you're using. If you click Catalog, you can either browse all the models in the current category or switch to the full catalog list. If you'd like to explore the Pathology section, you can click on the corresponding button on the top menu. Right now, there are 10 categories to explore, and we're always adding more. Pick a category you're interested in, and you'll land on a page that's a lot like the anatomy section, but with a twist. There are articles next to the models that you can save to your personal collection by clicking the star icon. You'll also see previews of all the models in the category you've picked. At the top of each list, there's a detailed model of a healthy organ related to that category. If you want to check out something else in the same category, simply use the left panel to switch quickly. Or, if you want to see the full list of categories, click Show Categories in the top left corner. When you click on an article, you'll get a detailed description of the pathology types and subtypes from an anatomical point of view, as well as how it shows up and how to treat it. Over in the top right corner of the page, you can save the article to your collection, copy the link, download it as a PDF, or print it out. Plus, if you want to see 3D models of what the article's talking about, just hit the Go to Pathology button. On the left side of the screen, you'll see a list of all the pathology categories with articles. Just click on a category to explore its article collection. From there, you can sort the items alphabetically or use the search feature to find what you need. When you're studying 3D models of anatomical pathology, you'll notice a new feature called Topography popping up in the top right corner, right above the layer list. This mode gives you a view of where anatomical structures are located, as well as their projections. Everything else stays the same, so you've got all your usual tools and features at your fingertips. To wrap things up, you can tweak your personal info by clicking the icon with your nickname and email up in the top right corner. Over on the left side of the page, you'll find options like personal information, change password, and theme settings. So you can personalize the VOCA Anatomy Pro interface just the way you like it. The mobile version of VOCA Anatomy Pro is pretty much the same as the desktop one, minus the presentation tools. Instead, you get to play around with 3D models in R mode. Just hit the R icon at the top right of your screen. When you're in R mode, Point your camera at a flat surface and tap to drop the model where you want it. You can rotate it, zoom in or out, hide or isolate parts, and see names for the structures you select. To switch back to the normal view, just tap the MB icon up top. And if you want to hide a whole layer of structures, just double tap on that layer. We hope this guide helps you get even more out of Boca Anatomy Pro. Thank you for watching.